Where some they start you they hurry to dance. How we do you now as you dance la 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 inside her zone? My biggest motivation, I don't know where I go be lost. For my biggest motivation, I don't say I don't see for sure. Say my biggest motivation, I don't say I see as you go here. For my biggest motivation, I don't say where they hurt. In this short video, we'll show the method of liquid penetrant testing. There are a lot of techniques of PT inspection. In this short video we'll show some of these techniques which inspect by using Visible solvent removable technique Visible water washable technique Fluorescent solvent removable technique First of all, we'll show the inspection which is using visible solvent removable technique The equipment and tools are White light Penetrant kit Magnaflux Cleaner SKLS, Penetrant SKLS P1 and Developer SKD S2. The penetrant kit shouldn't contain of elements which are cause corrosion in the material. However, nickel-based alloys shall doesn't have sulfur. In addition, the penetrant test consumables to be used on austenitic of duplex stainless steel and titanium shall doesn't have chlorine plus fluorine or halogen. Cotton rags. Weld samples. The procedure is Pre-clean with cloth dampened with solvent Apply penetrant to surface by spraying or brushing Allow proper dwell time And the penetrant dwell time is between 5 to 45 minutes in every technique Remove excess penetrant with a clean lint-free cloth then use another new clean cloth lightly moisten with solvent and wipe the surface to remove remaining traces of penetrant. Apply developer and inspect for flaws under visible light. And the developer application rules are. The distance should applied within 30 centimeters. The angle should be from 45 to 90 degree. It should applied in thin and uniform layer. Developer dwell time is in the range of 10 minutes to 4 hours. These rules should be in all techniques. Post clean. The advantages and disadvantages of visible solvent removable technique include It's highly penetrating and have the similar formulations to water washable technique Except it doesn't emulsifying agent and consequently are not soluble in water Also it's have the advantage of eliminating some of the danger of over rinsing The second technique is visible water washable In this technique, the temperature of water should be from 5 degree to 50 degree it should not exceed that range. In addition, the water pressure should not exceed of 50 psi. Also, the distance within 30 centimeters. The equipment and tools are White light Penetrant kit Magnaflux cleaner SKLS Penetrant SKLWP and developer SKD S2 Water rinse cotton rags weld samples the procedure is pre-cleaning application of penetrant and dwell time removal of excess penetrant by water washing drying application of developer inspection and the advantages and disadvantages of water washable it has a lower cost no emulsifier needed and fewer processing steps also process time is reduced 
but its disadvantages are include there is no control over the diffusion or emulsified layer. Post cleaning. The third technique is fluorescent solvent removable. This technique is used when inspect the material in the dark area. The equipment and tools are UV light, penetrant kit, cleaner, fluorescent penetrant and developer, cotton rags, weld samples. The procedure is pre-clean with cloth dampened with solvent. Apply penetrant to surface by spraying or brushing. Allow proper dwell time. Remove excess penetrant with a clean lint-free cloth. Then use another new clean cloth lightly moisten with solvent and wipe the surface to remove remaining traces of penetrant. Apply developer and inspect for flaws under UV light. And the advantages and disadvantages of fluorescent technique. It is highly sensitive fluorescent penetrant is ideal for even the smallest imperfections and potentially high volume. Also, it is more accurate, but its disadvantages include the cleaning that requires a long time and its cost is high when compared with other techniques.